The Texas man who orchestrated a gruesome hate crime was executed in Huntsville tonight. John William King was one of three men convicted in the 1998 dragging death of James Byrd Jr. Levi Ismail in Huntsville tonight hearing from Byrd's sister who witnessed the execution. Levi? Well, Clara Bird Taylor of the Bird family says she felt nothing when King was executed. She says that there was no sense of relief. All she knew is this had to be done. In his final moments, John William King avoided all eye contact with the family of James Bird Jr. It's indicative of how embedded his hate was and how proud he was of what he had what he had done. Clara Bird Taylor is James's oldest sister. It's been 21 years since her brother was brutally killed, but Wednesday evening, she saw the last of the three men responsible put to death. King showed no remorse then and showed no remorse tonight. His execution tonight was just punishment for his actions. When King was asked if he had anything to say, he responded simply with the words, no, did not open his eyes at any point during the process took one deep breath, one exhale, and that was the extent of it. At 7 to 8 p.m., King was pronounced dead. His request for a last minute stay was denied, putting an end to years of legal battles, which kept him on death row for two decades. I'm against capital punishment, but what he did is way over the top. It was a modern day lynching. James Byrd was lynched. So I don't want the world to forget this hell, and so that's why I'm here. For Clara Bird Taylor, closure means helping others understand hatred will never prevail. I think if you continue to embrace diversity no matter where you are, it's going to help solve the problem. Now, the Bird family says that while they have forgiven all three men for their actions, they will not forget. They describe it almost as a wound that's healed, although the scar will always be with them. Guys, back to you. All right. So hard all those years, and now this. Thank you, Levi.